All right. I was pushing it off again. Pause. We've cro- we've come to a fork in the road here. A fork in the dark. With me. You know. I fuck with Ye. <laughs> Don't make that sound. I fuck with Ye. Mm-hmm. But I might have to pull the plug, dog. No. No, 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 no. No. no listen, 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 listen. That's listen. your dog show. Listen. That's your dog forever. The Trump shit, it was hard to defend my dog. The MAGA hat, <laughs> it was hard to defend him. The Bro, Confederate it's, flag. It's going to be hard to defend him for the rest of your life. It was hard to defend him. No, this your dog forever. I started changing with the White Lives Matter recently, but now... Did you hear what he said recently? Mm, of course not. Oh, you did it. Mm. He went on Drink Champs again. Again? Oh, I definitely didn't see that one. Because somebody asked me that I hear Kanye. Well, you movie. won't be able to see it again. It's pulled down. Uh, They removed it. How you got it then? Oh, I mean, they they removed it, but oh. it's still online. But uh, I want to play a little... Uh, Part. A documentary that Candace Owens put up. One of the things that his two roommates said was they want a tall guy like me. They want a tall guy like me. And the day when he died, he said a prayer for, you know, eight minutes. Mm-hmm. He said a prayer for eight minutes. If you look, the, the guy's knee wasn't even on his neck like that. When he said, mama, he mama like is, is his girlfriend. Cow. They said he screamed for his mama. Mama was his <laughs> like girlfriend. That. It's in the documentary. Okay. So he went on Drink uh, Champs. This guy. And not only he just, did he say other shit like Jewish, like uh, he was about to go death con Jew. Or, oh, my God. <laughs> he was going <laughs> to. <laughs> I meant to say DEFCON 3 on Jews. I said DEFCON Jew. Uh, he's about to go uh, go crazy. Um, but on here, he said that he was explaining how JP Morgan was like, oh, are you going to talk shit about Jewish people? We're not using you as a, you can't use this as a bank no more. So they made him take his 150 mil out. They wow. just kicked him the fuck out. And people were like, well, he was actually proving their point. Actually, he's not proving their point. Listen to me. You own a business. You're going to let a white dude go in there and say, nigger, 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 you're a nigger, this, that, and the third nigger. And then you're going to let him keep buying from you? Right. No, you're going to kick him the fuck out. Right. You're going can- to feel like I don't need your money or this and that. Just because the Jews, <laughs> Jewish people, <laughs> just because the Jewish people <laughs> may have, they, have, they own J.P. Morgan, and they say no to anti-semitism that kanye was spewing that everything like just the type of shit like jews are jewish people are greedy jewish people are they own everything blah blah blah, whatever which even if they did who gives a fuck i mean what is the difference to you are you gonna change your life if a jew owns something right jewish people i gotta say same fucking jew jewish people own it no who gives a fuck so i don't know why people make that a big deal but anyway you, they they felt disrespected. They kicked you out. Who gives a fuck? But yeah. now, now the fact that you're quoting Candace Owens as a reliable source is funny as hell. Now she says in her doc that you explain that not only was the cop not uh, kneeling on his fucking neck, you're gonna say they shot him up with fentanyl. Okay. okay. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Let's just That's pull up. Boy. Let's just pull up the facts because you know it was, you know, the guy that did that is in jail for that. So let's just pull up what the me- medical examiner said. Okay, real quick. <clears throat> the medical examiner Andrew Baker testified that the way the officers held Floyd down and compressed his neck while restraining him was just more than Mister Floyd could take, given the condition of his heart. Similarly, in an independent autopsy commissioned by Floyd's family ruled asphyxiation from sustained pressure was the cause. 
Floyd family attorney Benjamin Crumb said at the news conference in June 2020 that Dr. Michael Baden and Dr. Alicia Wilson performed the autopsy, finding there was neck and back compression that led to back uh, to the lack of blood flow from the brain. Now, not only that, but when the findings from Floyd's autopsy revealed 11 nanograms per milliliter of fentanyl in his blood, medical experts called as prosecution witnesses agreed the amount of fentanyl was not enough to be considered fatal. Right. It was I mean, proven right. in court that it is not true. So you know they're going to go against that. Come no, but, but you say it. can't go against factors. They pro- a judge that has nothing to do with it ruled that it was not true. So, for you to believe that Candace, that Candace Owens knows more than the judge, <laughs> that, that what the judge said was wrong and fake, just proves my point about you niggas that follow this idiot, Coon, that they just spew bullshit. She yeah. just talks nonsense. Especially if you don't do no research, you're just going to believe whatever they give you. Because she's doing it for financial gain. I she mean, knows she knows that she is being used. She has to know she's being used by Republicans as I'm not racist. I like this nigga here. Candace. Yes. The blackest white motherfucker you know. Now. Kanye. Yeah, boy. It's say it's hard for me to say, bro. Too late. It's your boy forever. This one was fucked up. <laughs> this one was fucked up, bro. He crossed the line. Cause it's like, bro, this was like the first time we saw a cop really go down for something, bro. Yeah. For a long time. Yeah, yeah, for yeah. doing wrong. And this one you point out to say. His knee wasn't on his neck like, like that. that. Bro. What? Like what? Motherfucker. Hands in some... pockets. Kneeling. What do you mean well, like that? Like that. What's bro, the measurement on. for like you that? You have no control. Meaning you just like, bro. Anyway on somebody's neck like that. You lay down and I'll and kneel on you. Just let somebody like kneel that. on your billionaire ass. Yeah. Fucking sucker ass nigga. And for like our people, like Candace Owens... And Kanye, our color people, to say this shit for financial gain. That it's you fucked know, man. up. That's how it, it's just to let you know, man. Color shouldn't mean nothing. Because this is to show you, people is just people, man. Yeah. Like, it's not about the color, but obviously, this is how life is. Like, this is what we visualize. This is what we honestly see, even though we should just see a person for a person. Because we should just see these people for what they is as people. Not as oh this black motherfucker. No, it's just a person who's just just lost it. You see what I'm getting at? But hey, this is how the world is. But these motherfuckers, man, they ain't they ain't gonna save our color. They ain't part. Of, they just human. Don't put them part of us. Fuck all that. But that's part. It's like this one hurt. It's like this one. Uh, I can't ride I mean, with Kanye, dog, bro. Man. I can't ride with Kanye. Bro, like I one. said, nobody controls him. He controls himself. He's just a, a ticking time bomb. Oh, I'm not saying he's going to go anywhere anytime soon or die or no commit suicide shit. But no, I'm just saying he's just a he's just a blow up all the time, bro. He's just always going to hit you with something. Like, what the fuck? Like, and it's not going to stop, bro. He's just going to continue to do this shit because he just... I don't know. He's just a type of person where like you don't meet normally, but he just so happened to be successful. You see what I'm saying? It's like, it's a lot of people like them, but you don't rarely, you rarely meet them. Like, damn, it's a different ass person. This? He, he just so happened to be rich. In, uh, in there's a, a part two with this and why I got an issue. The drink champs. <clears throat> Nori. Oh, man. He, he look, I ain't his dog. Nori. He look, I ain't. He actually took died. it down and has been on an apology tour. Saying he shouldn't have put it up, he was wrong. He should have back. He should have stood up for George Floyd. Because mind you, in the three hour and forty five minute episode, I was about to say you could have can you cut that out. He no no well he could have yeah but he could 
of defended. Now here, let's play it. Let's be fair. When he said, uh, mama, mama, Nori this, does. This girlfriend. They said he screamed for his mama. Mama. Was a pro, he he confronts Kanye about those comments. <clears throat> Gotta be. A, but when you wear the white lives matter, kind of takes away from everything from black people. Because what it is is the same way you wore the uh, Confederate flag. Confederate flag. And we like, damn. And I know you. I love you. <clears throat> I fuck with you. You my brother. I, I, I take this. And I'm a real nigga. And I'm a real nigga in the streets every day. But even me, I question, like, why would you try to... Like, even when you said George Floyd, you said George Floyd, like, you said, I could prove that somebody was, wasn't on his neck. We don't even care about that. Because we don't care. But, but, but let me... Terrible you. response. We, we right. Black people, we, Black Panthers, we fucking the people that you gotta fuck with. You, we, we fucked with you when it was time for you to say that it's to fuck with you. We wanna continue to follow you. We do. You are yay. But when the white lives matter, we know white lives matter. We know that. But black lives matter when 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 we are getting killed every fucking single day. We have to notice that. But since that happened, we haven't got killed less. We got killed more. We broke I more shit up. You gotta say it's like what I'm doing is tight jeans. If you think about the mo if you think about a Meek Mill's outfit <laughs> and you picture him. Do you think about Meek Mill outfits? Jeans, but the same mentality would have been Beanie telling me and Pharrell to come out the closet because he was wearing tight jeans. Okay, anyways. So oh no <laughs> fucking so. guy, yo, this dude. <laughs> you know how many people he just pissed off with that line? Dumb. But Nori. Mind you, that response came hours after he said it. That when we played the George Floyd shit, that yeah. happened in the first ten minutes. Yeah, but he I responded. Mean, shit, as long as he still says something about it, bro, it don't matter. If, a terrible well, response. Long, it don't matter. Well, no, I'm saying no matter how long it took Nori to ask him, he still brought it up. Now, because I'm gonna give, tell just you, give it to him. Like, he, like you said, that's his dog. Like he probably didn't want to get into it at that time. He wanted to continue the interview and then because, like, yeah, bring that's, it back. He was thirsty don't for the interview a little caught, bit. Yeah, he don't want to be caught on one subject because that would have been a no, long No, because Ye would have walked out. Or that. He talked about he how, how he is. So, like you said. Ye like, showed up to that interview and was like, if you don't let my people film, we're walking out. So there was already there. That's supposed to be his dog. But they were like, the producer was fighting with you know how Ye is, a, is he for self, bro. Like, come on. If this so, supposed to be a dog, these niggas y'all come up in the same same like era. Like, in some instances, you can't go for the interview. Up, you have to attack the message, even though you risk not having a three hour interview. In no situation. Hey, fuck that. Get Bruh, the, I was about to say, get the message. Get the real point of the shit. You gotta, That's all you really need, bro, to be you, honest. You, Everything else is extra. You got to jump on them and be like, yo, first of all, what you're saying is completely wrong. They proved right. it in court. And what you're saying is fact. you're supposed to be my fact. dog, bro. I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with you? It's bro? not fact what you're saying. What you said was completely wrong. Point, not like even up said, to interpretation. You're supposed to be my dog. Fuck with this and that's like, I don't know if we really had to say you understand it. Like, damn. You see what I'm saying? We feel like totally opposite. I, if you came up here and said some wild shit like that, I am not waiting an hour and a half to uh, 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 like answer, hold like on, like to respond. Hell no, it's gonna be some Asia. Like, what, what do you whoa. mean? Like, yeah, hold on, yeah, bang, 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 yeah, chitty, yeah. chitty, chitty. No, you don't just say no. Nah. What do you mean on his neck like a that? A little, like yeah, like that. Like, the so fuck how you was mean? it? What is a light way to kneel on someone's neck that he admitted he did? First he of said all, it was in his training on his neck at all, right? But so he admitted himself he was doing it. At it was a training exercise. Yeah, you know how Mister Space Boots is, man. You, I mean, hey, so Mister Space Boots, yeah. Nori, I was upset with you, bro, because you a real one. Bro, don't be upset because he he, bro, he did what he had no, to do. No, he should have. No, he should have confronted it earlier, bro. And then right. and addressing then, it is addressing just it. because you were getting criticized no, I said you for can say it. If he didn't address it, all, he addressed it, bro. He took it down. No, I'm saying he addressed it. Regardless. Okay, yeah, but I'm saying he took the interview down. Why? Because it wasn't a good look. All right, that's fucked up too. Oh, yeah, I mean, just because you were still getting parts of it out you here, said right? something people were getting at you. Were screen recording the shit is out here. It's gonna be oh, like, it's out here. here. Yeah, of course it's not. But you guys, if he, he took it down, no matter. Took it down. He should have stood on it. Bro, he should have. I'm not. I'm not talking about that part. Now, that part, if you want to get on that specifically, yeah, I feel like he shouldn't have took it down. He should have stood on that because at the end of the day, I feel like, bro, regardless, you responded late. It don't fucking matter. He responded in the same context of the interview. It ain't like Ladies oh, Kanye fuck. left 
Came back, new interview. Oh, yo, bro, what about you said? Like, bro, why the fuck is people beating him up about some shit that he said the shit regardless? But the interview. shit he said was bad. Yes, we know that, but he's continuing the interview. He don't. He probably have a, no, a no, system no. going I'm on. I'm saying and I even don't when know. Nori himself said, by the time I addressed it, I was already drunk, so it was a terrible yeah, no, response. No, I was about to say at that too. We know he is a drinker, so that's probably that could be his main reason for his late response, right? We don't know sober Nori, right? Who knows him? <laughs> nobody. But the whole thing is, I feel like so nobody, why, nobody should be beating him up about this or talking anything about, oh, like you, oh, oh damn, I feel, man, Nori should have, bro, he saw us up, bro, he drink all the time. Get a man some slack, he brought it up, at least he fucking remembered to be like, all right, before the interview's over, bro, like, damn, this and that. He probably don't even know how to fucking say it. But look at what he said, though. It, bro. He don't even know how to say it to a billionaire, his friend. He probably even nervous why he even saying that. Like, uh, you see him nervous. Fucking jittering and fucking stuttering. Even in the response, he let Kanye say, oh, it's like comparing me and tight jeans. And Bro! What, and what did he say before that? How did he ask him? He asked him in what type of uh, context? He was stuttering, nigga. He, he probably was fucking scared. He don't even know how the fuck he was about to even say that to Kanye. He like, he like, mm, you know, come on, Kanye, you know. Bro, he, he was scary. It, it was like yeah, to Kanye. He, Kanye is like somebody big to him, right? So, bro, so at Nori the end of the day, killed he people saw, see, in his day. We ain't bro. talking about that. The way Nori he, look at him is a whole different, bro. whole different situation. Why you trying to get my boy Nori wrapped up? But I'm he just said saying. it himself. He said he used to go on the po- he used to go on the rooftop and just shoot down at the people and kill niggas. <laughs> See, you just you just say kill him, not he shoot him. He shot Prodigy. It didn't kill him. Or he shot at Prodigy. It didn't kill him. At the end of the day, don't get my boy wrapped up for some nice. He said it, shit. bro. But at the Prodigy end of the day, Prodigy put it in his book. At the end of the day, bro, you know you look at Kanye as a guy. You do, you can just tell the way he talked to him. He just <laughs> actually bro, Prodigy put it in his book that he bro, shot he the ground when he was saying he was acting like as if he didn't really want to. Straight out ask the nigga, bro, why did you go like that That's with George? That's why I'm Floyd? upset. You he, yeah, Cowardly. You, bro, you gotta think, bro. He saw us up. He's that he, should be real. He's starstruck. <laughs> Come on, you like that? You was would fire, get it. Right? You would. He <laughs> saw us up. Starstruck. Oh, you're rapping. Boss. Oh, come on, yo, yeah. Catch me on. Matter of fact, I'm nah, gonna go nah, on URL. Nah. I'm gonna start eating y'all niggas up, yo. Pause. Yo, any of y'all oh, niggas out? Yo, yo. F- Charlie <laughs> Clips, we're calling out. Charlie Clips, dog. Where are I'm we calling going? out? Stop, stop, I'm stop. I'm calling out all the niggas. My bad. That shit you just said was ass cheap. Yeah, I'm coming with fire, though. Pause. That was just some, uh, some light shit. But. <laughs> <laughs> But what I'm saying about Nori is, bro, you've been in way <laughs> realer conversations or it situations. Matter, bro, it just he said it. You should have went for the response. Would have went way more viral if you walked out, uh, bro. bro. What was gonna be the difference? You well, if he was go- listen, if he was just doing this and addressing it hours later, just so he can have the interview to put up, it would have been a bigger thing if maybe he, he walked out, bro. More, maybe, maybe he was just letting Kanye just look stupid. Let them just run along and talk retarded so all the people stop just really saying that word. So how fucking messed up he is. Messed Arsler. up he is. We know Arsler. You see what I'm saying? That's why he did it. Probably you don't know the reasons, bro. I don't know. Sauce. He could have been dragging the shit. Who knows? He knew when to say, "All right, I'm gonna ask this nigga about this later," but. I got something else on my mind. I want to ask him about this right after this and that. Whatever, bro. Come on, bro. Get a when man that motherfucker said he wasn't tacky, on his man, neck like it. that, you should have been like, of time course, out of course. and go. I would have been on it too. Me, personally, I'm like, what you mean on his neck like that? Like, you can't just, <laughs> we would have had a convo. I, bro, we not other people, so we cannot put ourselves in those situations. We just got to think for I them. Like, all right, well, it. maybe. So we got to give them some reason because we don't know, obviously. Because if they was us, obviously it would have been talked about. But they not us. Oh, coincidence. They not us. All right, all right, all right. But all, right. all I'm saying is we gotta put we gotta give some excuse for him. Cause we don't know why. So all I can think, Sauce, he 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 just like Kanye is just a guy to him, so I don't know. He's nervous around the nigga. Like, I don't know what I don't know. I can't but long as he responded, nobody should have nothing to feel no fucking way. He responded, he got the interview out, he let people, he got the interview. Let people know Kanye is really just. We already let you know he toe up, but this is just more evident. <laughs> it's just like hair, y'all. Up. It don't matter. That's like leave that nigga alone. I think I gotta 
Leave that bald head drunk nigga alone. I think I gotta put him. He on barely could keep bro. a fucking. He could barely say a straight sentence without stuttering. Oh, Nori. And slurry. Nori, I'm gonna let pass. No, I'm talking I'm about upset. Nori. I'm not talking about Kanye. No, I'm talking about Nori. Nori, alone. I'll uh, I'm gonna let pass. I'm upset, but I'm gonna let it pass. Yeah, I'm bro, still gonna watch go, the show. Man. But yay. It's just so hard no, fuck to let that. that bro, nigga, he done, bro. His music's so fire. You know, fire, I never though. was even fucking with him anyway. Uh, la, la, la. Come on, bro. I mean, it don't matter, bro. You don't. You know you like Ye. No. So you're saying you don't like no Ye? I fuck with him, yeah. But I don't. I don't fuck with him like that. No, I'm saying his music. Old school, yeah, yeah. Like, there's no way. I got new Ye. Remember I told you about him and uh. You were listening to Ye or uh uh the Jesus album. I did. Yes, the song that you oh oh with you at work. Fabio Foreign, yeah. No, oh, that joint, yeah. It's on the Jesus. Oh, I ain't know the uh, but Donda. Yeah, yeah, the, uh, yeah, that joint. I fuck with that joint. That was fucking twenty twenty one. Yeah, yeah. See, yeah, it's still yeah. Yeah, make, yeah, make that's like our Kells, bro. No, our Kells is way Kels worse forever, than though. Way but, worse than yeah. It's just, I fuck R. Kelly it. fucked children. I don't. That's not what I'm thinking about. Ye though. just says dumb shit. I'm not thinking about. It. Yeah, but he the songs were even telling you he was doing it. No, I'm not thinking. Yeah, about it. I'm not my mind. He's telling saying, me no. Well, it ain't never say. Oh, you're 11 years old. He wrote age is nothing but a number. But to he a never girl. said no specifics. Listen to, for a girl that was underage that he Obviously. wanted to make. A superstar. Rest in peace, my girl Aaliyah. He's way worse. Bro, we not talking about the specifics. No. We talking about not listening to a nigga because of his character compared to his music. Yeah, when you say Kells, but Kells is in a whole different spectrum. He character and his music, I don't know. I'll just fuck the music regardless. 